very interesting because when I click on Leskele or Nubai, uh, I don't get anything at all. I can't get to the CCs. No, well, even the Bulgarian one has no photo, no information about the players, just right in the heading, a tiny click for their convention card. I see. So, um, maybe nothing will happen until we see the first bid, because here we see the first bid, and we know that this is a multi. That we can see for sure. But no information available. That's what I still get. Well, I have got a convention card for the, the Bulgarians. It was just the photo that was missing. This is an always weak multi. Six hearts or uh, six spades. Well, it, yeah, that's right. Right. But I can get to the Finnish convention card, I'm sure, through the... EBL website, so, so let me go and look for that, David. Yes, well, I'm, most of you will be familiar with the basic responses to the multi. South two hearts means that he wants to play only in two hearts if that's hearts uh, partner suit. If it should happen that North three bid two spades to show that he was uh, that was his long suit. South might think again. He's only got 14 points. It's not much of a hand. Are he playing in America? He would uh, probably be looking. Wagner for his excellent view graph operating on the top table. So three down 
diamonds is perfectly full of diamonds. Mm -hmm. Offside. Let me just look the other. Top. Yeah, so it was two hearts passed round to West who bid two spades, and this time East didn't speak. And South then uh, raised the two hearts to three. So we can see how would they have done in uh, two spades. Both clubs are offside. Diamond lead. Mm. Well, they'd have done well to make. is forcing to game so there's no need for uh, even though East knows from that three heart bid that his partner has four spades there's no cause for him to bid anything more than three spades he doesn't know if his partner is just scraping up a raise to game or if he's heading for a slam West would announce with a cue bid over three spades if he was interested in the slam until he does that, at least has no wish to give away information on his hand by making some enthusiastic uh, move at his third turn. Yeah, right. Now, his real name is Leskele. Two dots missing over the A. But they don't do that in Europe. So let's call him Lescala if you want to, but it is Lescala. The man to the left, which Englishmen would normally pronounce Nyberg, right, is actually Newberg. Like Newstrom. You, you know that, David. Newstrom, the, the, the Swedish player. Yes. Yeah. Indeed I do. I believe I may have even pronounced one or other of these names correctly sometime in the past. I'm not quite sure what 2003 was it. Uh, no, no, 2011 it was. Yes. Oh yes. You, you the did. memorable moments anyway. There would have been applause all around Scandinavia. Absolutely. Now Finland is not a Scandinavian country. Finland is a Nordic country. But when you did it with Newstrom, obviously, they applauded you in Sweden. Well, I wouldn't like to say whether uh, Finland was Scandinavian in England. I mean, uh, they probably are, aren't they? You'd have to have an opinion poll of a thousand English people and ask. I'm sure I would have been voting for, for Scandinavian. And then you would have been wrong, because there are only three Scandinavian countries, Denmark, Sweden and Norway. Well, what's right and wrong varies from country to country, Roland. Here in England we have a lot of eccentric views. Oh, that's fine. Wonderful, wonderful, yeah. We even have a Scandinavian airline, as you know, Scandinavian airline system, and that is Denmark, Sweden, and Norway together. Then Norway has one of their own, also Norwegian, 
a low cost airline. We have a few low cost airlines in Denmark and Sweden has of course as you have in Britain and Ireland, of course, the Ryanair. What was the origin of the term Scandinavia? Uh, that's a good question. I have to look it up. So, haven't said much about the play here because we could see when Dummy went down that wasn't much interest with the King of Diamonds on side anyway. No, it was an easy ride with Space 3-2 and the King of Diamonds on. So, ten tricks and a flat board. Although the Diamond lead wasn't successful, that's the lead I very much like and has come out well in recent computer simulations. A low doubleton didn't happen to work here, but it's worked well because because you may be leading some part hand. Leading the King of Clubs might have been another possible choice, but they're going to trick away. Not have done as uh, well as the cards lie, yeah, it may have given the trick away. Well, the strength of opening bids goes down and down and down and often includes 10 counts, thank goodness. We haven't yet described that south hand as a one spade opening bid. Two queens, a jack and an ace. I dare say we may find one player out of 36 tables opening one spade, but let's hope not. Oh no, surely not. In the other room, we have Grand Old Man in Finnish Bridge, Kalko Koistinen North, playing with Fagelund against Popov and Skorchev from Bulgaria. So, North would like to open. He has bid two diamonds, which on the bit of their convention card I can see is a multi and a major only. I'll have to just move that and see if it's different in third seat. Mm -hmm. Any sort of shortage maybe, or could it be a week to a diamonds even in third? No, that is builders build on their card as being a straight Week two in one of the majors. But in that case, it's a psych, isn't it? Yeah, but I think the card must be wrong because South would have said something. He would. He has a wonderful fit for the majors, so if it really showed a six card major, he would probably even jump to three hearts with that collection. Well, we've already seen them open two diamonds when they did have a true week two, haven't we? Happened on uh, perhaps board one, was it? It was, yeah. So this two diamond opening is very strange. So there must be something to it in, in third seat. But of course it should be on the card. Uh, that that's a clear mistake. Well, their card is the leanest that I've seen, really. There's no explanation for any opening bids from four hearts up. And uh, they only say how high they play negative doubles for the one club and one diamond bids, not even for one heart and one spade. So it's not really filled in properly. But it must show diamonds. Nubay didn't bid three diamonds over two spades now. 
He, he didn't introduce his diamonds because Norse showed them. So it is a week two in diamonds. No, I'm going to do. I'm going to do what you you did and get the uh, convention card not from BBO but from uh, the official website. So I'll be away for a few seconds. It's quite interesting. Now they've bypassed past three no trumps, which might have been the best contract. Four spades is not a happy one. The spades breaking five one. Oh, he didn't double. The operator wanted to double, but then she withdrew the double. And the contract rates to go down. So a double would have been fine. Even three no tops has a problem. You don't really have tricks there. Four spades, a heart is five, a diamond is six. Well, maybe a couple of clubs for eight, but three no shouldn't make either. Well, I've got a better convention card out now, and it's got a mysterious final column that says competitive and past hand bidding. Two diamonds shows diamonds, but how can you <laughs> how can you open two diamonds on a past hand if there are three passes in front of you? So it doesn't make sense, but it does uh, seem to give a hint that uh, although it may be in the wrong column, that occasionally they do play two diamonds as natural. Yeah, but you have a better card now, at least. So maybe they forgot to add that in third seat, an unpassed hand, it is diamonds. Well, it's not much Just better, more. I can say that. Well, where are all the spectators this morning, I'm asked? Well, they're at the table with Vasaji Lauria, understandably. They're playing against Hungary, so that match wouldn't be an option for us anyway, because all Hungary's matches we have passed on to the locals, to our Hungarian colleagues, they have a cafe in Budapest where they show all hung Hungary's matches uh, on a giant screen. The contract is also four spades in the other room. They just finished the the bidding there, so we haven't seen the play yet, but it should fail. Yes, you can't judge just by five seven five second look at the cards whether he's certain to go down. You've got two aces missing and. Uh, 
Trump's sort of solid down to the nine, just missing the queen. But I mean, there's parts of me putting the club running the nine. Absolutely, and in the end game. But I mean, if if he ruts a club to, to avoid a loser in that suit, he, he he's going to have to uh, rough back to his hand to draw the trump, so he'll lose control anyway. It just wasn't possible to make it against that break. Now we didn't get to see it, but he did well in the end game as well to get out for one down. He he must have cast the queen of hearts and then exit uh, with a club. South was down to three trumps now, queen third. So he had to rough in and lead into declare us king nine for down one. So we'll see if uh, West is a believer in opening this type of hand. Maybe half the field would open it, something like that. And going back a few decades, people would see no purpose in opening a 4 3 3 3 hand with 11 points, even if it did have two kings and an ace. Okay, I agree with you completely. This has passed. But you know what? Well, I like I, that. I, I, I mean, if I'm going to open light on a sub-minimum hand, I like to m be mentioning a suit that I would like to have led. Yes, but I would double on my second turn. Why not? It's against the precision one diamond. Why, why wouldn't I double? Just, uh, I have four three in the majors. I have a past left-hand opponent. It's not dangerous at all to double with that hand. And I think you should. That silenced David, which means that he doesn't agree with me. But that is aggressive, maybe, but it, it, it's normal. I'm sure we'll see it at, mo at, at many tables. The important suit here is the diamonds, and they don't lie too well, because uh, Declare say if he's got time to finish the nine on the first round, benefiting if East has Jack-10 and then the Queen won't do him any good. He's got two diamond losers there. And uh, the hearts are offside. Spades are offside, so even though he may have the balance of the points, the cards just lie very badly for him. Only just a little, tiny bit of good news in clubs. See that West has decided not to put his king up, which uh, could only work if the lead was from ace jack 10 to 4 or 5 and maybe maybe they don't lead the jack from that holding in any case it's long odds that it is from jack 10 9 so he may not want to waste his king anyway I had a feeling that David couldn't hear me, and he confirmed that he couldn't. He had no red line, so he exited and is right. back now. Is that now better? you have got a red line. I, I, I just thought you'd... Uh, it, it just cut, suddenly cut off in, uh, in mid-sentence. You were talking about doing well in the end gate, and then it stopped. And I thought oh. perhaps Roland has fallen off his chair, or his finger has slipped off the button. Ended uh, up, I looked a fool by over-talking you, but I mean, it was just a system problem somewhere in the thousands of miles of internet. Absolutely. Today you are brolicious again. Sh 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 should we? She must have a macro with brolicious on it. Want me to send her a message and maybe correct it, David? No, not or, or send her one. No, I'm just sending her uh, one now. Okay. 
Well, not looking too bad for De Clara. I mean, he has uh, three diamond tricks now, uh, 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 and that's six, right? So that's a make. How did it? Yeah, we can't prevent him from taking four diamond tricks. Two clubs is six, and the ace of hearts is seven. No, three diamond tricks. But he got a spade as well. Okay, seven tricks, 90. And what do we have here? Nothing exciting. Four completely balanced hands. And is it a 20-20 also? Uh, I'm pretty got good at spotting 2020 hands. 11. No, it's 21.19. Should really be a pass out, but it isn't because South has an opener. Especially play, playing precision. He has an opener. He must open a, a diamond, I presume. Yeah. Now we have another exciting one no Trump contract. Unless East gets in with the majors over one. I doubt it. Four four and maybe two diamonds wouldn't even have been the majors for them. Maybe it would show diamonds, since one diamond doesn't say anything about diamonds. Uh, how many diamonds do do they have, David, when, when they open one? Well, I guarantee at least uh, at least zero diamonds, presumably on four four o five. Yes, then you should definitely play two diamonds as natural. But anyway, if you're talking about, I I just uh, had to leave because our front doorbell went. If you're talking about East bidding two diamonds to show the majors, I don't agree with that. On a four four three two, I mean it's. Uh, Hardly worth the trouble. No, I, I didn't rec recommend it. I said that he might bid ah, two diamonds. Good. No, 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 I, I wouldn't. No, no, not with four four. You see, that was a clever lead, a low spade from that holding, and reasonably enough. Declarer inserted the nine, which is with the odds, obviously, playing for honor ten on side rather than two honors. Twice as likely that East has honor ten, king ten, or queen ten rather than specifically king queen. That's exactly right, but of course it is standard to lead a spot card from that holding. Even from King Queen Ten X, where the books say you should lead the king, it can work well uh, to lead low if your partner's got Ace Doubleton or Jack Doubleton. But certainly, when you've got King Queen Seven X, there's no reason whatever to lead a top card. Having said that, uh, we're only speaking against no trumps. If you lead that suit against a suit contract, it is absolutely essential to lead one of the top honours, because nearly always a side suit is the third round will be roughed by someone or other, so you want your king and queen to play a role in the first two rounds. I expect the Clara to go after clubs now. The heart switch wasn't best, since that would give the Clara two heart tricks. But West had to play something. Looks best to go after the clubs. He only has seven cut fits. 
in, in both minors, uh, and clubs are stronger than diamonds, so he will go after clubs. With regard to West Switch, he had to guess really whether to, to switch to a diamond or a heart. I mean, it, he knows that his partner's got the king queen of spades, so the heart switch wasn't likely to be much use unless partner had the king. Maybe that wasn't particularly likely. No, it was pretty unlikely, but he could have that, of course, instead of the Queen of Diamonds, he could have had the King of Hearts. So, declare a thinking here, how should I proceed? He only has one trick, he has a certain spade trick, that's two. He doesn't even know that he has a second heart trick, although it seems likely. If West is trying to work out North shape, he can pro probably guess from the opening lead that East has got four spades, leaving North with two. And uh, if East would have led a heart if he had five, so probably, although North has denied four hearts, he's probably got three. So he could be two, three, three, five, if you think you can get a long diamond going by underleading the diamonds twice, or finding partner with queen to three. Or he could be two, three, four, four. Now he can make, if he guesses the layout, he has six tricks now, needs a seventh, and that will have to come from diamonds, and maybe there's no guess really, when he doesn't have the ten of diamonds. So spade to the, the dummy and the diamond up. Or well, yes, yeah, all the throw in here. Yeah, throw in, yeah. So the same contract failed at the other table, also played by North. So that's a gain for, for Bulgaria. Five imps, 100 plus nine. See that East had no good discard on the last club, he had to um, bear the spade, keeping a heart winner, and he had, if he threw the ten of diamonds away, then that would make it easy for Declarer to set up a diamond by leading low towards the jack. Well, at least we get some shape now, David. And four spades the likely contract, or four hearts the likely contract, and Clara can take, if they take two club tricks, if they don't take two club tricks, he'll take more tricks, then he'll take all thirteen, seven hearts, five spades, and the ace of diamonds. There we see an exactly. example of the precision club bid on a fourteen count, which they uh, say on their card may be possible, in fact, I've got a different, yeah, I've got this different card up, and that just says it might be 15, but the original one said 14, and obviously you're adding some sort of points when you've got huge playing strength like this, along with some top cards, I mean, you wouldn't open the club if you had king-queen to seven and king-queen to four, you would just bid your suit. 
We're in a positive response in spades, so it's natural so far. Well, it looks like they're playing natural. The idea of playing so many uh, asking bids, as in CC Way's original version, has faded away. They'll get to four hearts here as well. West will lead a diamond. And Declara will take the same 13 tricks Declara did in the other room. No way West will lead a club. So South has got three to the jack in a suit where he knows his partner has five. But with such a fantastic seven card suit as that, he's not in the least bit interested in playing in spades because, say, a diamond lead and uh, you might not make many heart tricks, but if they're trumps, then you are. Right, now his partner has not raised the hearts, but bid the spades again. So, north is unlimited. It may must bid four diamonds, I expect, now from south. Well, that put, would pinpoint the club lead if he does. Yes, but that is the aim of, of bidding to discover whether a suit is bare, unless you're going to leap straight to six and hope they don't lead it, which isn't a very good idea at this level or at any level. No, we've seen quite a few hopeless slams making. We saw that is in, in the Israel-France match. We saw that yesterday also, David, when you were not here, when England were playing. David Bakshi and David Gold got to six note trumps, off two aces. Right, well, don't rub it in that I'm not there when England are playing. No, 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 but you might, you may know what happened. They made the contract. Yes, well, I'll look through the board someday on the view graph. Yeah, so they had to cast the two black aces. Sasu had the ace of clubs, led a spade to partner's ace, and he had to switch to a club. Dummy had king, queen, jack of clubs. And when he didn't, the slam made, because hearts broke 3-3. You had ace king to five hearts opposite to queen x. And running diamonds. So south has bid four diamonds, a cubid, and north is now offering to play. There we go. Uh, it wasn't that clear, and uh, south bid four spades just in case. Four hearts was a cue bid, and he, he was bidding it to show that he had a club control as well. But North knows absolutely for sure there's no club control, so he's bound to pass four spades. I, I think four hearts should be semi natural because you shouldn't. Yes, but the idea is that your bidding system should tell you that that is possibly to play, even if you can't deduce the fact that it must be because you happen to have ace and king. So it's not a very uh, easy area of the game, particularly you can see on this sort of sequence where South might, well he might have bid four diamonds with no space control if he had a good hand, or he doesn't just want to sign off in four hearts, so it seems quite reasonable that four hearts should be suggesting to play that. Uh, I, I don't really understand why Leskele didn't lead the club. Act on this auction. Well, well prob probably. It is all as four hearts was a cubit. With spades agreed, in which case it would show a club control. He, he probably didn't know. Or he could have asked them, I suppose.
Well, this time we have a 20-20 hand, full balanced hands. They won't get very high. The boards haven't been exciting this morning, David, but we have been lucky other days, don't, don't you agree? We have so many interesting oh, boards. Yes. Well, even when they're not exciting, I mean, if you've got the world's top players ahead of you, it's always a good watch. We've had some absolutely fabulous sessions. It seems that they're either fabulous or, uh, you know, not <laughs> decidedly not fabulous. We don't get many in between. I was feeling a bit sorry for the people who uh, set their alarm clocks to watch uh, Loria Versace play against the home team and they had all the players they wanted to watch but not the uh, wonderful board so far to make it entertaining I'm just glad that I told Mark Horden that I would be writing up North Poland in round two for my uh, bulletin article rather than this match. So on this sort of bidding sometimes West might choose to rebid one no trump without a spade stopper say if he had jack to three he might hope his partner's got queen or king opposite it and he still wants to show the nature of his hand I mean if if the shape is such that they've got no fit then you might as well play in no trumps even if the defenders are going to take five spades against you might still be the best place to play rather than playing in a seven card trump fit in the other room, they wrong-sided, no trump, so that South could lead the eight of spades. It makes such a huge difference. Not only does the Clara have two spade tricks now, he also has time to set up his hearts. Contract would still go down with the King of Diamonds off, but maybe not four down. At least he could take his heart tricks first. Well, he doesn't know he has three heart tricks, obviously. He doesn't know anything about the nine of hearts. He will have to, of course, overtake the ten if the nine doesn't show. But he can take his three hard tricks and then decide from here. If he plays a diamond now, then they can take lots of tricks on defense, as you see. In fact, the Clara won't get more than one more trick if he takes a diamond finesse now. North is, of course, of course, a hot favourite to have the King of Diamonds. Once South showed the Ace of Hearts. Why did he do that? I don't think so. He didn't. Of course he overtook. So now he's cashing. The best he can do is to take the Ace of Diamonds next and take his six tricks that will be worth seven imps if he does if he doesn't he won't get any more but He may well take the diamond finesse. I mean, he can't be quite sure how the cards lie just because he's overcalled a spade. It's true that South said nothing, and uh, 
he would have quite a lot of points because North, yeah, North could still have the ace king of clubs, I suppose. Ah, he, he played as if he knew the cards. So well done, new back. So I was asked whether uh, North was right to lead a spade on the basis that South didn't find the Rosencrantz redouble if they play that. He might have redoubled with King Doubleton. Well, that's true, but I was always leader, leader spade anyway. You've got to try and make a lot of tricks against one no trump, and your partner's not going to get in too often. So I certainly would have uh, led a spade from that, and partner might still have Queen Doubleton of uh, spades, so then he would be a redouble. Even if you play that redouble to show uh, double to nonna, it's not normal with the queen in case partner they end up in a suit and partner underleads his ace, something like that. Yeah, I'm asked, why not a club lead? Well, I think that's resulting because you can see all cards. Yes, a club lead would have been great to South Jack and then a spade switch from south. That would have been great, but I understand the spade lead. I'm with David here. Why wouldn't you lead a spade? got to remember that five card suits are the very best suit length to lead from if you've got six partner may have a singleton. So even if you do give a trick away on the lead, you're going to set up some long cards in the suit and uh, you need a lot of tricks <laughs> you need a lot of tricks to beat one no trump yes i think you realize that so silly thing to say well okay maybe they can't show hearts and diamonds after one diamond opening remember one diamond says absolutely nothing about diamonds as david said earlier it could be no diamonds if if north north had four four void five both of those shapes four four oh five four four one four and what he actually has four three one five are examples of uh, a two diamond opening in the early versions of precision which sh showed less than 16 points only one diamond and originally it showed uh, only at most one diamond originally it showed four four in the majors but to get more mileage from it, a lot of players started bidding it on 4315 because it wasn't very attractive to open a diamond, and uh, a lot of players like to have sort of a six card suit when they open two clubs, or, or at any rate, a reasonable five card suit. So they preferred that rather than opening two clubs on a bad suit. Now, Marashev will do well to pass here. Because if he bids again, East West may get tracked. Remember that South has not made a negative double, and he would often scrape up a negative double if he had four spades. We see here that he uh, he didn't bid it because it had only five points, and the queen of the suit, which uh, was bid on his right. So I don't think one spade is an attractive bid. Oh no, no, no indeed. By North, because he can't expect there to be a spade fit. Well, well done anyway. That is a very good pass by North. A lot of players that might not think and just bid a, a spade. So I like very much North's pass. Well played. It was much easier for the Bulgarians in the other room. When North opened the club, that would be the normal opening if you play standard. So East could get in with two no trumps.
to show the two lowest unbid suits, the red suits, uh, hearts and diamonds. Obviously West preferred diamonds, bid three, he couldn't bid more really. But East raced to four, he said, well partner, if you have just a little something, race to gain. And that's what he did. And when they didn't lead a spade, he made an over trick. Well, that was well done. I mean, East's actions were totally obvious to bid two no trumps and four diamonds. And uh, West, well, he made the right decision. I mean, uh, I think he deserves a little praise because some people might say that the clubs could be absolute waste paper and the singleton heart is not necessarily a uh, good holding to try and set up the second suit, but he does know he's in a, a fit of at least 5-4 in diamonds. So it was a race to five diamonds, but still, if you keep on making uh, the right bids in situations where it's only 60-40 or you always find the, the bid with the odds, then you're going to do well. Yes. And West realised that he had more than he could have had for, for his three diamond bid. The fourth three diamond bid could be a three card suit. He could have nothing on uh, outside. So he found uh, something extra. But, but, but I agree, yeah. He was hoping the partner would be short in spades rather than clubs. And he knew partner couldn't have many cards in spades after all. I mean, he had shown at least ten cards in the red suits. Speaking in very general terms, everyone seems to agree that um, inexperienced players, when they first start out on the game, their eyes light up when they pick up a strong hand, and they generally overbid such hands. To match that, they generally has. Now, West has got a bad hand. Well, compare what you've got with you might have, and uh, calculate what the odds are. Not just say, "Oh gosh, it's a rotten hand. I'm going to pass." So it may have been a, something of a close decision, but he got it right anyway. So if you just make that jack of diamonds of a nine or something, then it's uh, still playable, but not so good. So another precision opening here. Would you get in with one heart, David? It's not much, much of a suit, but you do have compensating values. Ace, king, ace. I think that half the field would bid a heart, maybe more. South doesn't like to pass in case his partner's very short in diamonds, or not particularly likely. So he's uh, he's he knows his partner doesn't have 16, and if he's got 11 or 12, the opponents will have a game on. So he's responded in a suit that he doesn't have. And <laughs> Looks like his partner's made a support double to show that they've got a, at least a 4-3 fit. Little does he know. Yeah. The support redoubled this is here, but it's the same. So three card support for hearts. Thank you very much, partner. Just what I wanted to hear. <laughs> so East would be very happy to make a further redouble were there a some purple card to that effect in his bidding box. Yeah, you, you may call me a simple soul, David, but, but, but I would have passed one diamond. I don't yes. care how many diamonds partner has. I'm not going to lie about my length in a, in a major. Well, certainly no one could be faulted if they did pass. It's just a question of how you assess the odds. may cause you a problem, as it may very well have done for North-South the way it started. But 
responding light as Michael Rosenberg recommends he would obviously bid on that hand he says that he always responds to a one bid which is how much of an exaggeration that is only he would know right so East West can make three now or can they well they have four they have four diamonds, a club is five, and three spades eight. So maybe this can be defeated if the defense doesn't set up a hard trick for declarer. If they switch to clubs in time, there is a chance that they can defeat this. Bates don't come in. Are we going to play this? We we need a ninth trick. Yes. It won't hear. Well, he knows his hearts are three three from the bidding. Well, that's true. So maybe he'll go after hearts now. But then, if he does. They have time to switch to clubs, right? Yes, but he hasn't lost anything, has he? Because uh, he couldn't do any further work himself. Well, he hasn't actually put the ten in, but I mean, uh, the spades can wait, and so can the diamonds wait. And he doesn't want to play clubs himself, so I mean, there's nothing to do but play on hearts. No. His nice trick could be spades. He could take a finesse, which would be with the odds, but surely not after south one heartbeat. With, as you said, uh, he knows hearts are 3-3. Three, three. And why would south bid a heart if he had four spades? Now let's see, if no switches to the ten of clubs, ten, king, what should West do? And maybe the, the clubs are blocked so that he can afford that. And then he has to lose three hearts and one club. Yeah, I think he can do that. He'll only lose one club with the jack protected. South six of hearts will obviously have been a count card. They probably play reverse count signals. I could look it up in a moment. And that would alert North to the position because obviously if the South had got five hearts, first of all he would have led one and secondly Declarer wouldn't be leading hearts himself. And they may often have to bid a three-card major over their short diamond, so he's aware of the... Well, anyway, I mean, East wouldn't have a stopper in that case, would he? He wouldn't have bid two no trumps, so... You can see the Queen, he's got Ace-King-Jack, so he knows East has got 10-9, to 5 so... It looks to me as if, uh... Probably he has got to try the 10 of clubs, unless he thinks... that his partner's got something better in diamonds well it doesn't look like it after the lead of the seven spade is out of the question obviously I, I, I think he, 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 he will switch to the ten of cups unless he wants to go passive in diamonds and hope that he'll score his jack of spades. Well, 
Right, they do play reverse count signals as expected, so the six showed an odd number of hearts. And they lead second and fourth, so they lead second best from three. So I think North has more or less got a count. He's more or less got a count on the hand now. He knows his partner wouldn't have led the seven from Jack seven five two. He would have led fourth best. So it looks like South is going to have uh, three 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 four. Yeah, but he, he also knows that the king of cl clubs with partner doesn't really help him. Because they can't untangle the suit. South can't have more entries. So that gives the Clare a time to set up his heart. Well, that sometimes happens. You can work out an absolutely perfect map of how the cards lie and work out that the Clare is going to make it. Some players would still sit for another two or three minutes to work out if they, they've got their calculations wrong. So, yeah, he did play partner for the King of Clubs, but it's not good enough. There's still some danger for De Clara. He's pretty certain that the Queen of Clubs is with North. He doesn't know where the Jack of Hearts is. But if South has it, he can't make it. Unless he can make it legitimately by going after Spades. In case. Uh, he finds uh, Jack third, which would be with South in that case. Do you see the problem he has? Because if South has the Jack of Hearts, he knows he's down when a club comes through. And maybe he had nine tricks all along if South had Jack third and Spades. Yes. And if he tests the spades, he sets up a fifth trick for the defence. So it's not so obvious. So he'll win that dime, presumably, he'll win that diamond in the dummy and play a spade to the ace. And then he has to decide who has the jack of hearts, who has the jack of spades. Well, I don't know if he could read the diamond suit as it was, but I mean, maybe the defence have done well to let him know that he's got four diamond tricks, because now he has, as you mentioned, the chance of bringing in the spades without needing any heart tricks. But, but, but wait a second. Could North really have the 
uh, could South really have the jag of hearts? I suppose so. Because Norse could have the jag of diamonds instead of the jag of hearts. Or could he? If they lead middle. We've seen the nine of diamonds already. Remember, Norse opened an eleven count as it is. We have seen the King of Clubs in the South Hand, and but I'm told that they opened ten balanced non vulnerable, so Norse could have ten. Thank you. It's not clear cut. Easy for us to see what he can do and should do. Very, very difficult for De Clara. Yes, on some of these hands you just would be able to test the spades and if it went wrong you'd have some uh, hope that they couldn't get to the, uh, the jack of spades, but he knows that they can really here, so tricky yeah. decision for him. And, and Sotchev did very well not to, to, to play the Jack of Diamonds, you see. If he plays two more rounds of Diamonds, provided that he plays Diamonds to be 3-3, three, three, then Norse is in trouble on the last Diamond. Now you play a spade to the ace. And cash your last diamond. What should Norse discard? But you have to discard something from the dummy as well. So you discard a club there. And then it's Norse. Well, he might dip, pitch the jack of hearts and hope that his partner had the ten. So that's not so likely on the bidding. So he did well here. Yes, he, he, he can make it in a couple of ways now. But will he? Well, he had no entry for the hearts, if he'd uh, exited a heart. No, he, could have, he should have exited a club. Now he's down. He, 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 he played for South to have Jack's third in spades. That was an interesting board, David. Very interesting. It wasn't clear regarding the Jag of Hearts. Much, much, much easier in the other room. And what lead do you think he got? A spade from Jack Fourth. Uh, and that was his nice trick. Mm. Yeah, well, yeah, it was a good board. Yeah, I quite agree with raising to two hearts. A lot of people would say that, uh, you know, you've got heaven knows how many losers. Eleven or eleven losers. I mean, taking away a whole level of bidding, that's bound to be a good idea. West's three hearts is just further preemption. He could bid a new suit to make a game try. Yep. South double is known as a responsive double. I have cards, partner, but no clear direction and probably not four spades. Yes, 
that's very helpful to play that rule that you you don't have four spades. If you've got spades, you bid them. If partner doesn't happen to have four, then that's just the premium you pay. But what a dividend you get by uh, by telling him that you've got the miners on this sort of hand. So um, North didn't have very much. How many? What would they have done in diamonds? Hmm. They've got three. Spade losers. Yeah, and maybe a heart. Maybe a heart. They would have made three well. diamonds with, without a problem. But it's not a big deal for North South because this is going down. Takara has a diamond loser, three club losers, and a spade. Sorry, a heart. Looks like you might make four diamonds if you can uh, play Ace King and another club to set up the ten for our heart discard. The spades breaking three three. There still is some danger here for the defense because the six of hearts is an entry to the dummy which means that declarer has two entries to lead towards his queen of clubs if they don't take the club rope. Well, remember that South has shown the minus. So even if he only had ace to four in clubs, he could uh, duck a doubleton club switch and then North could come over to the ace for his rough when he wins the ace of trumps. Probably got a count signal there, reverse count on the king lead, so he knows there no he knows both from the signal and the bidding that there are no more diamond tricks to come. So he and he knows his partner has got three spades at most, so that switch isn't so attractive. I think he'll quite like the Jack of Clubs now. Yes, but even if he doesn't, he'll get a second chance when he's in with the Ace of Hearts. Say he continues diamonds, he'll get one more chance. Declarer would play a trump. Then he is in with the Ace of Hearts, and now they can take the rough. Let's see if it happens. Yes, but he would have lost the rough in the situation I mentioned where uh, South just had Ace to four. I don't know what the point was of that second diamond. Well, there we are. Just now, now they can't defeat it anymore. Oh, well, I think the second diamond was a waste of time. He knew it wouldn't stand up. He needed either club tricks or a club rough. Uh, nope. I understand that defence. No, but, but that's one thing to 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 actually point out here, note how Declarer carefully roughed with the seven of hearts, then later with a highish heart, retaining the five, so he can get to the dummy. Yes, you may argue, well, that's standard uh, at this level. Perhaps it is, but you still have to do it. Yeah, well, I would say that a club switch was pretty standard as well. He's got to think what no, tricks are going to... No. He knows there's one diamond, one heart, so where else has he got to look for tricks? I mean, you could not necessarily fault him if he, if he switches to a spade, fair enough, but, I mean, a diamond is just giving up, I think. But Declara gave up here. What's the point of playing a third spade? Okay. He didn't. Obviously, he played a club. It's not Wagner, David. Why else would he retain the five of hearts? He he had seen it already. So obviously, when he 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 crossed the dummy's ace of spades, he led a club up. Then later, the five of hearts to the six and another club.
Yes. Well, anyway, as we, as we said at the time, North had some sort of guess as to which black suit to play and ended up playing the Ace of Diamonds, so... Strong club again. And, I mean, West should bid some number of hearts now. I can't stand it when people say, oh no, well, we don't come in on good hands, we uh, we only come in on bad hands. What's wrong with bidding, uh, bidding hearts? Have you got any meaning for the double on your card, Roland? Yes, double is a good hand with either five hearts or five spades. Gosh, well that's pretty pretty good. And one heart is pass or group. Probably yeah, five three to double seven. will be five to, five to seven. Yeah, if he had a positive, he would make some some bid, and redouble is uh, a call. And but he's got close to a positive five to seven. Indeed. Two diamonds is non-forcing. So east one heart was pass or correct. Pass if you have hearts, partner. Correct if you have spades. Right, they have nine tricks in no trumps. And surely South is going to bid three no trumps, so they've done well. Absolutely. Wasn't so easy in the other room. One diamond by South, one heart. North had no bid. He passed. East bid a spade. Now South doubled. West redoubled. He had a good hand. Pass, pass to South, who bid two diamonds now. And North still couldn't bid. And that's why they played in two diamonds. Yes, well, this is uh, pretty good for them to get to three no trumps. Again we can see the redouble was forced and why should he not bid two no trumps when he's got a heart stop and it was obvious to bid three. It doesn't look very clever but if we look down at the results of all 36 tables we'll see that for some reason or other it may well be that a good fraction of the field weren't able to find their way to game. Roland gave an example where and uh, describing what happened. Yeah, I, I think it's pretty impressive, isn't it? 16 opposite 5? You don't make many 3 no trumps with 16 opposite 5. But, of course, if you have a running suit, it helps. How did it take 10 tricks? Did I miss something? Maybe I did, and maybe it didn't matter. Did he have more than 9? Maybe they set up a heart for him. We didn't get to see the play. Yes, he returned a low heart at trick 2. He won the ace ah. and played a low one back, and the eight won. Uh, I see. Yeah, makes sense. Eight imps to Bulgaria, and ball twelve now. Five balls to go before a break. The break for me against Poland seen on board nine that in the other on the other table they made three no trumps so let's see what happened spade lead which doesn't seem to be the best oh I see spade lead yeah no, that's right that helps them then yes I, I said that maybe you couldn't hear it um that's one possibility. Or oh, maybe I'm going senile and didn't remember you saying it. 
it hadn't registered for for one reason or another anyway. Yeah, I, I said it was played by West. And what lead did yeah. it get? A spade. Indeed. It rings some sort of tiny bell in my ancient brain. Well, if you lead force best from any holding, South can't really play small here. Maybe in many places you would lead the seven from a nine seven four three. Isn't that standard in Britain, uh, David? Yes, but uh, Declarer would still know that the king was on side after a seven lead, really. I also play the three, I have to say, because we think it's more important to give count in the suit rather than attitude. But it's a matter of agreement and style. They're slightly ahead of us at the other table. As far as looking back at the boards we've seen, well, it's a little bit early to uh, be marking the effort made by the great dealer, but even though we've seen quite a lot of imps, I don't think it's any better than a three out of ten set of boards, so I'm not not that impressed, but maybe he can edge it up to, say, a maximum six if he gives us some excitement in the remaining boards. Well, I'm not including this one uh, in the same sentence as the word excitement. Okay, you'll be happy to, to learn that England is not now in the top six. They are fifth. They're winning big against Cyprus. You say, well, easy to beat Cyprus. Well, no easy opponents, really. We saw how Belarus the other day beat uh, France, the leaders. Georgia winning against a strong team. Can happen. Yes, and these boards are not that brilliant for trying to score a score big against one of the supposedly weaker teams. This is the fourth one, no trump contract. Now, not many imps are going to change on those. So maybe they have done well to uh, get a few big swings. I mean, England were within one bid of getting to the Bermuda Bowl final last time round if they didn't finish in the top seven in, in the European with us having our best team out for not having it happen often. So we'd be pretty disappointed. No, a lot. They never did. Go on. I was going to ask you. I mean, they never did reassign the medals for the European Championship, did they? After all those cheating scandals, they said they had to do it before this championship if it was ever going to be done. So I suppose they just let it stand. Yeah, they didn't revoke uh, the, the, the medals. That's true. But you, as you may know, that some of them sent their medals back. No. Who sent them back? Well, at least there was a Polish team. Uh, Polish team? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, there the was one Polish player who actually did when they had Balickas Muczynski on the team. Uh, and I believe... W oh, Germany did. Germany did. Absolutely. When they had, uh, you know, that pair Smirnov and Pikarek on the team, yes, the Germans did, all of them. Yes, if I remember rightly, England got the bronze medals, and had they adjusted it, that would have been promoted to gold. 
the two teams ahead of them. Well, it's nice that they send the medals back, but uh, there we go. As would I, if I would ever be in that situation. I mean, how can you keep a medal when you've been on a team with a pair who didn't play according to the l rules or laws, if you like? I, I, I mean, you just can't bear it, can you? To have a, a medal on your shelf. You didn't do anything wrong, but you had a pair that did. No, it's not so easy for them, of course, to uh, redress the balance. Because if what they do is to remove all the matches played by the cheating, uh, the, the teams with the cheat in it, then that can have a very random effect on on people's scores, jumble up the lists. If you just pull out the uh, teams from the medal table and shift everyone, that's a possible solution, but not absolutely clear cut. So. It's fair enough to leave it as it as it was. Mm -hmm. In America, they did the same. In in one of the nationals, uh, with the team that had Fischer Schwartz on it on it, they rebuked and said, "Well, it's not our title." So they gave the trophy back. It wasn't a question of medals, but to say, "Well, we didn't win it." was the Schwartz team, do, do, do you remember? Richard Schwartz. Yes, but I mean that event ends in a knockout and there it is absolutely impossible to uh, to work out who should get the medals instead, but at least if it's an all-play, all-round robin, you could just move all the teams up and that would be reasonably fair, no one could object to that. In the US uh, DC events, well, you know, if you've been knocked out in the quarterfinals by a team that had cheats on it, then, I mean, who can say what would have happened if you hadn't been? No, true, but they don't uh, award medals there. So when the Schwartz team, the Richard Schwartz, went on, on to win the event, they say, well, it's not our win. And was it Jimmy Kane also? who did the same, I think they had a pair on the team, can't remember which. Was it Fantunis? Or was that also Fischer and Schwartz? I don't know. Never mind. Yeah, but I mean teams have lost qualifying points to get into the Bermuda Bowl trials. They may have lost uh, some of deals. So sort of dozens of players have been uh, damaged, but there's no way you can redress it. It's just a sad story all around, and let's Look at board 14 to say if that's something more cheerful we can talk about. Well, it was rather exciting in the other room. Two diamonds doubled making. I know it's not game, only 180. But action. North says thought he had defence against two diamonds doubled. Indeed, he has. Looking at his cards, it looks like he has five tricks, right? If, if he can cash three club tricks. But that was a disappointment that declared I only had one club. Not quite. Well, he had a redouble when one no trump was doubled. Why can't he just pass and see what happens? Would have put more pressure on East. I see. So they lost one of their trump tricks in the other room. Jack of Diamonds led to the ace. Oh, I see. They, they, they had three natural trump tricks, right? Three trump tricks, one club is five, four, one heart is five, and, 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 and a spade is six. So the contract should have gone down. Yes, but I mean, if North had passed, and he's only got two queens and three jacks facing a 15 to 17 no trump, for all he knows, uh, West is going to run off a whole lot of diamond tricks or something. He, he wasn't going to try for game anyway, so he should be happy to make one no trump doubled. I mean, it, 
uh, if he'd have passed, I can't see East is going to bid on a 4-3-2-4-1 a count. His partner may have 22 for all he knows, and they'd have made one no Trump double. No. Well, Probably with an over trick. Yeah. The question is whether West should get in here. I know he did in the other room also, but that wasn't over a strong club. That was over a strong no Trump. So double probably in the other room showed four of a mi major and, and a longer minor, the multi-landed defence. So he had a hand for it, and so one, one can understand it. Can they penalise East-West now? Because they are in dire straits, even in two diamonds, although it wasn't defeated in the other room. Well, because North hasn't shown any points whatsoever, if he passes now, not that he will, no, he doubles, and now South may leave it in, yeah. South will leave it in. Oh, from bad to worse, North is going to double that one as well. It's not a good bid, is it? partner wouldn't pull into a four card suit if he didn't like two clubs he's likely to have five why on earth should two spades be better should remember that the double was for takeout there's no reason why that was going to be left in it's not as if he's looking for somewhere better after a penalty double South is a little concerned here. Partner bid one diamond, zero to seven, and he made two doubles. Should he be concerned? Partner must have something close to a maximum for his initial one diamond response. Surely this is penalties. Pass and lead a top. Chicken. That got that spade. What? Why would he be too no Trump? Uh, oh, maybe he intended it as showing the minors. I see. East West to bid clubs and diamonds. Anyway, I think two no Trumps may have some play. No, I don't know why West doubles this. He shouldn't double it. He knows his partner's got a bust because um, there's a w one club opener and North has shown a maximum non-positive. What's the point? Gosh, I don't last. I don't like that double. <laughs> no need for partner to discourage when the dummy goes down. No, no th 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 he this is the make. Should in Unless give a count signal. The only chance for the defence is that West sh switches to a low heart. It can't defeat it legitimately, obviously. And West should really be marked with S King of Hearts after his double. Double of one no Trump, double of two no Trumps. So De Clara shouldn't really go wrong, but that's the only chance. It's just such an annoying hand for Finland because they were really in trouble on two spades doubles and South didn't read it right and let them off the hook with two no trumps. Now they hand them a huge score. 
There we go, it's obviously gone up with the Queen. It's just such a shame when you're let off the hook and then you just jump on it again. Right. It didn't take him many seconds to go up with the Queen of Hearts, did it? Surely West must have a... No. And poor West has to discard now. Three discards he has to find. So he can afford two diamonds and a spade and still hold it to eight tricks. Well, I'm sure that his partner will have given him a reverse count signal at trick one. And, of course, he did bid two spades. So uh, he knows that he can afford to throw the two of spades away. He doesn't have to hold it up to stop De Clara getting over there. And, you, you, you know, I, I mean, you can be fairly certain that uh, uh, hearts are 4-3 on this auction. They must be. Otherwise, the, the auction doesn't make sense. You may argue that it doesn't make sense as it is. Well, if West had ace-king to five, he would have led the suit. If West had any, th East might have redoubled for rescue over two diamonds to get partner to choose one of the um, one of his four card suits. Yeah, Declara is pretty confident that he's making this, uh, and that's the trouble with doubling two no trumps. It will give the opponents a game bonus when it makes. Is he really thinking, or did we lose the play? But we have analysed no. it, and we can s see well, eight I'm, tricks. I'm sure he is thinking, but it's such a shame to be thinking for minutes now and not to think before the double of two no trumps. Yeah. He knows West is three four five one. I'm not saying that it would have happened, but it's not totally impossible that North was planning to raise two no trumps to three no trumps. And his partner might have had 18 or 19. Yeah. How strong was the one of Trump bid? Uh, David, 16 to 18 or something? What would a w well, one of Trump opening be? I'll have a look, yes. I mean, uh, usually it doesn't include 16s, we'll see.
No, the one no trump opening is 14 to 16 non vulnerable, so it would be 17, 18, 19. Yeah. So, so he upgraded when he opened the club. Yes, I suppose so. Maybe because he had all his points in two suits. Well, that's a pretty obvious end play, you know, forcing West to to lead away from the Queen of Diamonds for your eight trick, and that is what it's going to do sooner or later. Hmm. Well, now they can defeat. They could have defeated it. West had to play his partner for the Jack of Hearts to get a diamond through. Mm. So he gave it. He gave it. Now he got the opportunity. Well, he got the three of Hearts, which I'm assuming is a attitude when he led them. So he was taught to do and he didn't spend any time thinking about that. And thought in the middle, wasn't it? That's a shame. Well it is. De Clare was marked with the Ace King of Diamonds. So he knew that he couldn't play diamonds from his side. So he would have to hook for the Jack of Hearts in his partner's hand. But I mean, if Strange. Declarer really played that way, he gave them the chance to beat him, so maybe it didn't go that way. I don't know. It was sad for Finland, that's all I can say. The bridge hasn't been great in this set. Uh, David, I, 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 I think uh, uh, we can say that safely without insulting the players. No, well I thought the contract was completely cold so I wasn't following it, but uh, more alert Kibitza is saying perhaps South needed to play a spade before the fourth club. Were you, were you following it at all, Roland? Sorry that I wasn't. Yes, yes, in, in, indeed. Yeah. Would that have made it that that was on top if he did that? Yeah, the, prob the, the, the problem was that he had no way back to his hand then. Uh, I think he was down when, when he cast uh, four rounds of clubs. Right, well I'm definitely not going to give the great dealer any more than three out of ten, despite it being 49-15. So, just means that by the law of averages, the next set is absolutely certain to be a stonker. Yeah. Thank you very much. I'll be sitting out and be back for the third and the fourth. So you have time for lunch and furthermore you will have time after the England match to, to write your article. Well I'm not doing the England match. So oh. No, 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 no. Uh, slip up the tongue here. Sorry. Um, after the Norway Poland match. That should be a yeah. good one as well. Oh, that'll be a good match, yeah. It's only 10.45 here, so that would be an early lunch even for me. For me. 
Anyway, um, maybe, maybe, oh no, <laughs> I was just going to say maybe the next board will be interesting and I just looked to see what the result was at the other table. Anyway, so now, seeing, uh, bearing that in mind, I better very quickly uh, thank the operator. She did us a pretty good job, yeah, well done, that was fine. Thank the players for uh, their efforts, although really not so much they could do, and uh, there were a few slip-ups, as Roland just uh, suggested with his comment. So it's not been one of the better ones, but I mean, we've got so many sessions, 36 sessions. Of course, if they were all spectacular, then we wouldn't appreciate uh, it when we do get a really special board. Thanks for BBO for supplying this uh, wonderful platform for us to enjoy these great tournaments and for everyone working so hard in Hungary. Seems to me I haven't heard any complaints whatsoever, so it's all running smoothly as far as I know, and they're certainly playing in uh, absolutely splendid surroundings, sports stadium where they are. Yep, thanks of course to Roland for my co-commentator, yeah. It's always good when we're together, we've done a lot of sessions over the years, Feel a bit, if I feel a bit <laughs> spirited, it's just because of the boards. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll be okay as soon as we get to board two of the Poland-Norway game and some splendid deal appears on the screen. Cheer me up. Yeah. And your headset is great. So that, that that's good news for you. Yes, I did buy some sports headset which was reduced from 90 quid to 12 quid on the internet and it was hopeless it was very uncomfortable and then uh, it didn't actually work the first time I used it on BBO it's got a USB plug and all that USB plug does is to light up some lights on the top of the headset so it's obviously designed for a teenager playing some sort of battle games not for some aged commentator on BBO. So I've uh, the other one, which has works fine. Then the sort of cloth covering over the earpieces is beginning to wear out. So I bought a spare one just in case that one of my sets failed in the middle of some important one no Trump contract in a international event. And I've unpacked that this morning. Glad to hear it's working okay. I have the same problem. Room. How was a board one with a USB plug there? Uh, and I can't make it work, really. Well, it's okay on Skype, but when I want to listen to my hear a sound. So, my son is coming by tomorrow to see if he can fix it. If not, it is not. That's what sons are for. Gosh, when our son comes down, he really, I, he's not like me at all. Cleaned up our patio with a power water jet last time he came down. Took me on a trip to Stonehenge on the final morning. Yep. Yeah. Sons can be very useful. Now, um, w w w one of one of the reasons uh, that this set has been well rather dull is that we've had so many balanced hands with the points divided. But you know we created swings regardless. They exchanged sixty nine, which is uh, uh, about four per board, uh, and that's pretty normal. Well, can this actually be passed out at both tables? No, North is going to prevent it, perhaps. No. North has a perfect hand for a two-suited major. Oh, and here we have it. It's probably what it is. Spades and hearts below opening strength. Be uh, David will tell us in a second. Yeah, four to nine points and four five or five four either way around.
Well, one tiny consolation is that we only had to watch four one no Trump contracts there. In the, had we been in the closed room, it would have been five. Yeah. Mind you, there was also a, a one heart bid. And we had one, two, three, four game, no, five game contracts. No, so for trouble. Well, seven out of sixteen. Now, was it right to open? Is the the, the the question? Can he make it? Well, he could have made it opposite the west or the east hand, where he had a bit of a fit. Spades are breaking. Ace of diamonds is on side. Mm. Can't make when winning had four three 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 on both sides, then uh, he's too high. <laughs> yeah, east west have a mirror. Mirror, three three four three. I think he's okay actually. As it is, half three three on a, on a side did so mm, looks like it. So another club through, presumably. East knows partner has the king. He might as well. No point in continuing trumps. Uh, I, I, I mean, he has nothing in space himself, so whatever is out in 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 in, in space will, will be with partner, and, and then it would be finessable. I, I, I don't really understand this defense. in the uh, Belgians game they've played 12 boards and the score is 7 inch to 6 yeah. Belgium against Germany Bulgaria Finland that's our match is <laughs> highest scoring at 49 to 15 so everyone's wishing they'd been at this table <laughs> there we go yeah how are Hungary doing? They're just 10 inches down to Italy after 14 boards, 28-18. Yeah. And I believe you were at that table the other day when we had a very good match in the women's. France against Poland. Low scoring match. That was much better standard than we've seen in this match as it happens. It was a really high quality match with over 1,500 spectators and I know we've done DBO commentary on a few Bermuda Bowls and uh, when they people say well we're not seeing very much of the women and they put up Venice Cup matches and really there's a derisory uh, viewing figures so to have 1,500 here was absolutely marvellous and the, all the spectators who came, they stayed because they were very impressed by the accurate bidding and play and no uh, silly mistakes and so on, ending in bad contracts. So it was really, really good match. Mm -hmm. It was, yeah, France against Poland. Yeah. I'm hoping for something silly this afternoon when I'm on for France against Denmark in, in, in the women's. Hopefully that will be a good one. Right, remind me of the star lady on the Danish team who's editor of the Danish Bridge magazine. I know there's an MADS in there somewhere. Yeah, Christina Lundmassen. But she's not playing. <laughs> oh, she's not in the, not in the team, or, yeah. No, she not? no, no. Why no, she no. play Open Bridge? No, no. Uh, they couldn't make it. Uh, I mean, her partner was not available. She's a, a medical doctor. 
uh, and she wasn't available. She couldn't get the time off from the hospital. Well, you know that's hap that happens when you're not pro when you're not professionals. You see. Sure does. If it's a ten-day tournament, who could get the time off? Got to have, got to be working for the public sector and have a very understanding boss. Yeah. Well, I think he could have made it at some point. Well, obviously not now. When they get an extra trump trick with the seven of hearts. Then he's one down. But, consolation for the Finns, not a lot. They get two imps. Could be three, could have been three for Bulgaria. So, thanks everyone. Hope you enjoyed it, nevertheless. Good luck to you, David, for Norway, Poland. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, thanks for sticking with us, even though it wasn't so brilliant. And uh, there are three more matches today, and you can be pretty sure, if not certain, that there'll be more interesting boards on off on offer. And you may find that neither of the uh, commentators is as grumpy as I've been complaining about the boards. There's a very good chance of that, so there we go. It's not so bad. Bye-bye.